Shiden, can we talk? What do you need? I'm busy. There's something that's bothering me about your actions during our operations. <laughs> okay, Ms. Leader. Go ahead, say what you want to say. You fly solo too often during battles. From my calculations, you do this about 30% more than the other members. More importantly, there weren't many cases where it gave us an advantage. How about you coordinate with the rest of us? What? Did you not hear me? I'm suggesting that fighting individually doesn't play to our platoon's strength. I follow instructions outlined by the operation. Or is babysitting you guys part of the plan? I didn't ask you to babysit. Combining our strengths is a more efficient solution. We all have unique powers. Complementing each other with what we lack will help us fight more effectively. Our operations have all been successful. I don't see a problem. We could be stronger if we continue to train. Are you satisfied with our current state? You don't have any right to say that to me. I'll fight my own way. Stop trying to boss me around. This isn't an order, it's a suggestion. Are you alright? Do you have a problem with your hearing? What did you say? Now, now, you two, don't fight. We're all on the same team here. I only suggested she didn't cooperate with us more. Seriously? You were giving me a whole lot of attitude for someone asking for my cooperation. Okay, calm down, the both of you. Listen to me. Shiden, your fighting skills and analysis levels are excellent. We all know you're capable of working on your own. However, you're part of a team. Don't you think it's worth practicing coordinating with your teammates? It's not easy to adapt to a sudden change. So why don't you start by becoming friends with Kasane? Friends? Kasane, you've taken the initiative to think about our platoon. Our team will become stronger if we're able to coordinate well together. But just telling someone how you feel isn't enough to reach an understanding. There are many ways to communicate. Why don't you study the people around you and think of creative ways to do that? Creative? You're both good kids. I'm sure you'll get along. Do your best. I don't need friends. If I'm strong enough to fight alone, I can beat the others without having to rely on unnecessary coordination. That's fine with me, as long as you don't hold us back in battle. Are you saying I'm holding you back? Yes. First, you charge into the front lines alone too much. You lose sight of your surroundings when you get excited. <laughs> your overconfidence and poor follow-through are also concerning. You always lose focus and relax when you see victory at hand. I'll do better on the next assignment. So you're aware of this. Good. Everyone has faults. As perfect as we try to be, we all have limits. That makes relying on your teammates a necessary strategy. Fighting alone will get you killed one of these days. <coughs> Shiden? He seems angry. Was I too harsh again? Are you mad? I apologize if I offended you. So you point out people's weaknesses in order to claim superiority? That's not what I do. It doesn't matter who's better or worse. Fine, be like that. But I'm never losing to you. I'll conquer all my flaws and weaknesses on my own. Now don't talk to me anymore. I've really made him mad. I guess this means I didn't come up with a creative way to communicate my thoughts to him. I'll have to work on that. I bet Naomi would be able to handle this without a problem. I have to figure this out on my own now. I have to think of a way to get along with him. What are you doing? Kasane, I I'm not doing anything. If you're trying to hide it, why don't you go somewhere people can't see? It's hard to ignore what you're doing to that doll. What? How long have you been watching? A while. What's the point of this? 
I don't need to be bossed around by you. This is just small talk. We're teammates. Don't teammates talk like this? Small talk? Okay, fine. This is called Baki. I know that. Naomi liked it too. My parents pushed it on me because it's popular. It's completely not my taste. Then why do you have it? It's your fault. Huh? Because I lost you one-on-one. -on -one. My parents are trying to cheer me up. You told your family you lost? Of course not. When I didn't reply for a while, they probably figured out what happened. They've been messaging me non-stop ever since. They even sent me this doll. They probably think I like it. But that's just added pressure. That's why I don't want to reply. And just looking at the message notifications ticks me. So you were taking it out on the doll? Yeah. You got a problem with that? I think that's better than taking it out on the people around you. Oh. So you weren't making fun of me? Ah. What was that sound? How are you doing? We haven't heard from you, so we've been worried. Your mother and father are always on your side. Your mother knows just how strong you are, little Shiden. Do your best, and don't lose. I can't wait to hear from you. See you soon. Did you see that? I'm sorry, but I did. She's a good mom. <sighs> These are the types of messages she keeps sending me. I'm a grown man now, but she keeps treating me like a kid. You actually messaged through the terminal? They pushed it on me. I mean, we can directly receive transmissions through the brain, but they want to go through all this trouble. I don't understand why you're so resistant. You don't like being encouraged by your family? I'm grateful, but sometimes it doesn't matter how hard you try. There's some things you just can't accomplish no matter how much they expect you to. So when they keep telling me to do my best, it feels like they're blaming my inadequacy. You're so immature. What did you say? Ever since I was adopted into the Randall family, I've never received a single word of encouragement from my parents. I don't mean to compare our lives, and I can't say who's better off. But from where I stand, you're loved and truly blessed. I would even say I'm jealous. I'm sorry for saying all those things without thinking about your situation. Still, my family's encouragement stresses me out. My parents will praise me no matter how spectacularly I fail. That's no way to measure my abilities. I need to be acknowledged by an objective third party if I'm going to improve. You're not satisfied being loved by your family? I don't understand why you work so hard just to be acknowledged. Of course you don't. You're the one who won. So I'm just inferior. I trained so hard for years. And it resulted in a pathetic loss to a rookie. I know you must be laughing at me behind my back. I'm not. I just don't understand why you need the approval of others. If you explain it to me, I'll try my best to understand. You want to understand? That's what I'm telling you. Huh. I'm busy. I'm not obligated to explain anything to you. He has a lot on his mind. I'll need to talk to him more if I'm going to understand him. I had no idea communicating with people was so hard. Kasane, listen, I'm not planning to get to know you or the rest of you more than I need to. That's fine. I try not to get involved in other people's lives. Right. You don't look much like the social type. That's one of the few things we have in common. I'm not sympathizing with you or anything. J just get out of here! I'll talk if necessary, but I don't feel like it right now. Alright. Everything seems to be in order. Are you using a battle mask now? That's a good idea. No, I don't plan on using it yet. 
Really? It looks brand new. Captain Seto left this for me. Oh, he did? I guess they found it when they went through his belongings. And it finally made its way to me. I see. That's nice. Yeah. But when I look at this, I can feel how much expectation he had for me. I'm not worthy of this mask yet. I'll use it once I'm stronger. Don't you think he wanted you to use it right away? You say you want to wait until you're stronger, but do you even have a concrete goal? Well, when I'm as strong as him... How many years will that take? It's not going to take years. I'll be as strong as him real soon. When I was a rookie, Captain Seto would always encourage me, telling me I could succeed. I want to live up to his expectations. If I don't, then I have no right putting on this mask. He cared about Captain Seto. I heard that someone found his fountain pen. Was that you? What if it was? I thought so. Thank you for that. You don't need to thank me. I just didn't want his belongings discarded on the street. I know exactly how you feel, but why did you let me have it? Because you needed that pen more than I did. I saw the way you looked at him. I know you admired him. What? Wait, don't tell me you didn't even realize it. How did you know? It's pretty obvious. I looked up to him too, but I'm pretty sure we had different types of feelings for him. Different how? Figure it out yourself. They're your feelings. Ugh. I've never given my feelings for Captain Seto any thought. Anyway, I let you have that fountain pen. I swear, if you don't take good care of it, I'm coming after you. I'll treasure it. Thank you again. You've done a lot to help me. Where's all this coming from? Listen, don't get the wrong idea about me. Things can come to light even after a long time passes. I have Sheedan to thank for making me realize that. If platoon morale drops, it affects me too. So, it's not like I was doing it for you. Oh, I'm sorry. Could you say that again? I was a little lost in my own thoughts. <laughs> like I'd say it again! Damn it! Besides, I bet he would have done the same thing with the fountain pen. Really? I know he must have cared about you too. He was a really good person. He was a great mentor admired by everyone. And someone who meant more than anything to me. I no longer have anyone that recognizes my abilities. But I'll continue working hard to someday reach his level. If your goal is to be like him, why don't you work on your people skills too? I'd much rather use that time to work on my abilities. People will naturally come to me as long as I'm irrefutably strong. Then that means you're not strong enough to have people follow you now. What's wrong with that? I know I'm nowhere near him. It's good that you know where you stand. I suppose you're planning to work hard in order to reach his status. Yeah. Things can't stay this way. You just wait. I'm looking forward to it. now? Yes. What is it? There's something I want to ask you. Come with me. Why did you bring me all the way here? Because nobody will overhear us. Look at this. That's the analysis from a recent fight. Don't worry about the details. I want you to look at the other kill rate. Your numbers have been improving lately. You must be seeing results from your training. Yeah, but you're doing even better than me. Not by much. It's all within the margin of error. Listen, that small difference you're talking about is something I've never been able to make up for. It doesn't make sense to me that no matter how hard I study and work, I still can't beat you. It's time I swallow my pride and ask you, what kind of secret training are you doing? 
secret training. I'm not doing anything like that. No. There has to be some sort of secret strategy you're using. I told you I'm not doing anything like that. If you watch me, you can see that I'm not doing anything special. Are you saying that this is just a difference in our natural abilities? How? If that's true, then it doesn't matter what I do. I'll never be able to catch up to you. I don't really understand. Is there a reason you need to catch up to me? I should just be some baggage the rest of my life? I don't think so. I hate to admit it, but everyone in this platoon are top talents, even Kagero. I'm the only one that's different. I'm nothing compared to the rest of you. I have to work myself to the bone if I'm even gonna keep up. And it's paying off. I don't see you as baggage. Even after looking at the data? No matter how hard I train, this is the reality. If this is my limit, then I can't stay in this platoon! Shiden, what should I do once I catch up to him? I don't know how to tell him how I feel. Kasane? Shiden just rushed out of here. Yes, I'm sorry. It seems like I've upset him again. You don't need to apologize. I know you must have tried communicating with him. You two have such different upbringings and perspectives. You have to assume you'll have disagreements. That means he'll never understand where I'm coming from. Right. What do you want him to do? What do you mean? I want him to continue fighting with us as a team. Have you ever tried telling him? Why don't you catch up to him and say just that? I have a feeling he might get angry again, but I haven't thought of a better way to reach out to him. Okay, I'll go after him. Do you have any idea where he might have gone? Shiden is heading towards Seiran. Haruka, how do you know his location? I'm the team's operator. He just rushed out of the hideout, so I figured you two got into another fight. Good call. That's exactly what happened. Thank you for telling me. Good luck. I hope it goes well. There you are. Kasane? Why did you come after me? Get lost! Where are you going? <sighs> I understand that you're troubled. I can see how discouraging it is to work hard and not see results. But running away just because you couldn't become stronger than someone? That's not the kind of person you are. You just overestimated me. This is what I'm really like. I'm not even that good. But my pride makes me constantly worry about everyone around me. I put on a facade because I'm scared I'm inferior to everyone else. Don't take this the wrong way, but why are you so obsessed with being better than everyone? How useful an individual is depends on circumstances. Have you ever been unable to control your own abilities? You mean my power? Yeah. When I was young, I caused an accident because of it. Nobody got hurt, but I was just lucky. The next time it happens, someone might get hurt. Worst case scenario, people might even die. I put on these insulation gloves and trained hard to control my power, but I can't get rid of that nagging feeling. Even back when I was still a kid, I've never been able to overcome my own weakness. So you feel inadequate? I've never found you lacking. Our platoon needs your composure, analytic skills, and judgment. Please, come back to us. I want to keep fighting alongside you. I... An other warning. Kasane, Shiden, others have been confirmed inside Seiron City. Others? There was no forecast. Sometimes the forecasts are wrong. Look, there are still citizens inside who weren't able to evacuate in time. Let's go. We have to save them. Yeah. Haruka, send us the other's location. 
That's right near my home. What? You didn't know either, Haruka? Is there a suppression force heading there now? There's a patrol in the area. They should prioritize evacuating the nearby civilians. My family should have already evacuated by now. We should head to where they appeared. You must be worried about your family. I don't need your concern. A member of the OSF should prioritize saving the citizens over their own family. You can drop the act. If you lose them without doing anything, you'll regret it for the rest of your life. Okay, I'll go. Yes, let's hurry. Wait, you're coming with me? Obviously. Hurry up or I'm leaving you behind. Hey, why are you taking the lead? I'll support you from here. You should be careful. What's going on? How are there still this many others? The reports were wrong. There aren't even suppression forces. Let's go help. Wait, will we be able to hold back that many others? Shouldn't we wait for reinforcements? If we don't act now, they'll start attacking people. We have to slow them down here. Against this many? That's suicide! Who else is going to save them? This isn't a question about if we can do it. We have to. Damn it. I know that. Captain Seto would say the same thing. There's no guarantee the civilians will be able to get away before the reinforcements arrive. My parents might... So we're the only ones who can stop them here. Captain Seto, give me strength. Let's go. You better pull your own weight. Right back at you. Let's do this. I'll support you. Give it to me, Arashi. Enemy is done. It's working. Focus on that spot. The enemy is attacking with electricity. You'll be shot. I'll do it. It's over. Ah. And unable to move if it hits you. Ah. It's over. Drop something rare. Please, Joker. Keep your guard up. This is pretty good. Useless. Check me. Sheeden's electrokinesis might work. It's up to you. Wait down. Let's finish it. Leave it to me. That's all of them. Are you all right? Of course I'm all right. Who do you think I am? I was careful not to let any of them get away. I'm pretty sure we managed to stop them all here. Haruka, this is Shiden. We exterminated the others that appeared at our current location. Are there any more sightings? 
I was just about to contact you. We've confirmed that all others in Ceyron have been exterminated. You two really pulled off quite the feat. Good job. There's a rescue team headed your way. All the civilians have been accounted for at the evacuation site. Zero casualties. That's good news, Shiden. Thank goodness. Why don't you go see your family? No. I just needed to know they're okay. Then let's head back to the hideout. Sorry. You did well out there and made some good calls. You really pulled your weight. Enough with the flattery. I was too busy fighting to think about anything else. That just shows how much you were able to focus. Neither of us had the time to think about anything. I guess so. But this wasn't an official deployment. There won't be any data to evaluate. Does that upset you? No. I feel accomplished. I don't even regret putting on Captain Seto's mask. If that's how you feel, then that's worth more than any analysis data. You're right. This is the first time I've ever felt that there's more to an encounter than stats. I think I'll stay on the team for a little while longer. You can stay as long as you want. <laughs> it's only as long as I feel I have something to gain. This platoon isn't as bad as I thought. I'm glad to hear you say that. Thanks. But I was hoping you'd run some military exercises with me. We can go now. Let's head to the training facility. Damn it! I thought I could win this time. I can't believe you turned the tables on me at the last second. I may have managed to push through at the end, but it was really close. Thanks. That made for a good training session. I noticed you move differently now. It's like you don't hesitate anymore. Don't analyze me. You shouldn't get carried away just because you beat me. It was a compliment. I know, but I guess it's fine. I'll learn from this experience and win next time. Just you wait. I appreciate your passion, but remember not to push yourself too hard. You'll make your family worry. I don't even have to be pushing myself for them to worry. They never listen to anything I say. You have good parents. You had better be replying to all of their messages. I am, but they still won't stop bugging me. I decided I'm gonna drop by and see them once in a while. That's a good idea. I'm sure they'll be happy about that. They're constantly asking when I'll be coming over next. I mean, don't they get how busy I am? You always talk about them like that, but I know they're important to you. You just can't admit it. That's normal. You're just too blunt. Although that could be why you're so strong. You fight for what's important to you without being bothered by what anyone else thinks. That's a strength that can't be measured and utterly incomprehensible to me. But I did learn something while watching you. What would that be? Real strength isn't something you compare against other people. Everyone, including me, has their own unique strengths. Anyway, don't get cocky just because you're a little talented. I'm eventually going to surpass you and run the OSF one day. And here I thought you'd actually grown as a person. You haven't changed much at all. What? Although, it would be off-putting if you suddenly changed overnight. So I guess this is better. Nothing but insults, as usual. Are you really trying to become friends with me? About that. I know what Kyoka said, but I don't think we need to force a friendship between us. What? We may have different ways of thinking, but we can trust each other on the battlefield. Don't you think that's good enough? Uh, we're fighting in the same platoon. I suppose I can at least be cooperative. I'm glad we've come to an agreement. I'm not saying you're suited to be a leader or anything, as much as I hate to admit it. You're babbling so much I can't follow. 
What's your point? I... I mean... You're doing a good job. For now, at least. Spend enough time with anyone, and it doesn't matter how much you... Don't get along. You somehow 